It is definitely fall season. Today is a chilly day and it's forecasted to rain later. The perfect food for a cold day is nabe, also known as Japanese hot pot. Let's go to the supermarket and go shopping for ingredients. Today, I'm going to Eon Mall. The mall is family friendly and even has carts like this that can keep your child entertained. They had a Shikoku fair going on by chance right outside the grocery store. They had lots of local foods that Shikoku is famous for. I was intrigued and bought a couple things to try, like this. It says, Nihonji nara tamaranai. Apparently, it's irresistible if you are Japanese. I also got this pickled ginger that will go great with rice. Now, off to the grocery store we go. Another reason I love Eon is that shopping is very quick and easy with their Regigo system. Just pick up one of their Regigo phones, pick up a sanitized basket, and scan items as you put things in your cart. I like to set my Echo bag in the basket so everything is already packed when I pay. Let's try scanning some ingredients. Since it's getting colder, they started selling a lot of different nabe broths and even have pre-made nabe sets for one person. After buying everything I need, I go to the special Regigo registers and scan the QR code at my register. All the items in my cart get loaded to the payment system. I choose my payment method and boom, all done with my groceries. So convenient, quick, and hassle-free. These are all the ingredients that I like to put into my nabe. We have hoksai or Japanese cabbage, a variety of mushrooms, tofu, and meat. Let's prep the ingredients. I like to cut everything in bite-sized pieces except for the meat. The meat is already prepped for nabe so I can just put it in the pot when it's time. I can use this pot on my IH stove and a gas stove because it comes with this metal plate. So once the vegetables are cooked, I transfer the pot to the gas stove so my family and I can share the warm meal. For dinner, I'm going to use this flavor of broth. It comes with the shime, or what you choose to close the meal. It's usually rice or noodles. And you use the leftover broth and make a final last dish. Today, the shime will be ramen. Nabe is such an easy dish to prep because all you have to do is wash and cut the ingredients and then throw everything into a big pot. The meat and veggies deepen the flavor of the broth as it simmers. Mmm, it looks so good. Let's eat. <laughs> when eating nabe, I always have to remember there is shime at the end. I like to cook the noodles directly in the broth. The flavor seeps into the noodles and it's so flavorful. Many regions in Japan have their specialty nabe, so be sure to check it out while traveling. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye!